In this episode, we asked Lauren what assets can make or break a guy's chances. The guy with the dog, that definitely is a plus. I think that shows that he has a big heart and he might get my digits if he has a dog. The guy with the cat definitely would not get my digits. I do not like cats, I'm allergic to them, and it's a little too feminine for me. A guy with a reptile? Maybe. Reptiles kind of creep me out, so I don't know if I'd give them my digits. I definitely wouldn't give a guy with a wedding ring my digits, because it's just creepy. If a guy with a broken leg asked for my digits, I would definitely give him my digits, because that shows that he has confidence. He doesn't exactly have everything together at that point, he's kind of a little off. If a guy with a yoga mat asked for my digits, it just seems a little bit feminine to me, but hey, if you do yoga, I mean, good for you, I suppose. The guy's hair is somewhat important to me. I kind of like guys who don't care too much. I mean, I want them to take a shower and have good hygiene, but not anal retentive, not perfectly sculpted hair, but maybe just sort of like messy hair. A guy with a man purse, that's a little bit disturbing. I try to have an open mind, but um, that's a little bit of a turn off. Sorry guys, no downward dog for you. Lauren thinks that's too girly. But hey, some girls like when guys show their feminine side. What about you? Has a girl ever turned you off by being too bro -y? By spitting or punching, acting like a man, burping? We won't say farting, because we know we don't do that. 